Well, he's a glorious little mouse. All right, oh, let's go, everyone. Yeah. Yo. All right. Um. So, you guys continue traveling on the road. Very tired. You have two points of exhaustion, which means that you have disadvantage on all ability checks. Uh, your speed is reduced, I believe. Half. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, let me just get that up so that... Yes, your speed is halved, and you have disadvantage on all ability checks. Yep. You are both in incredibly tired, uh, as mm -hmm. are... Everyone else on the car is, is tired, but to a lesser degree. Ankh is perfectly fine. Uh, doesn't seem to be missing a wink of sleep, and Older is tirelessly older. So, um, Beautiful. My glorious so you, creation. Yes. You travel for a few more days, and the rough uh, mud road, much to, I'm assuming, Dimble's satisfaction, uh, gives way to cobbles. Uh, these cobbles are weather-worn, uh, and, and probably worn from tread and various other things. Uh, and and the, the sun is beginning to set and is giving off sort of a vibrant, uh, purpley sort of tinge to the um, to the sky, so the path is still like dimly lit. Mm. Uh, as far as cities go in this country, uh, Vico is uh, relatively inconspicuous. Uh, it's it's not got these like towering walls or anything. Um, no grand monuments or anything like that. Um, it's just sort of it's essentially like a very large town. Uh, more than a city. Okay. Um, hmm. uh, the the Pretty outskirts good. of the city themselves just seem to sort of like fade into the land around them as opposed to just like suddenly it's city. It's like, no, you see like spots of like farms, small houses, and then like the, the sort of presence of people gets more dense and more dense. And then eventually like you realize, oh, we're in, we're in the city now, like almost suddenly. Um, but it's, it's, it's pleasant. Uh, houses begin to come into view. Um, a sign greets you, its paint is slightly worn, but you can see like in red calligraphy the name Vico written on it, uh, off at the side of the road. And the, the whole atmosphere of the city is warm. Uh, you catch a few glances of people who sort of like smile as you go past. Um, you see some children like play fighting with some sticks at the side of the street. Uh, and you continue to move further in and begin to see more of, uh, sort of more signs of business and less signs of uh, civilian life. Um, and you see uh, sort of like the uh, the whiff of spring uh, and baked goods and that sort of thing being sold around the place. You see like some people carding wheat. Um, you see two people like having an argument over large crates. Uh, and your eyes sort of follow this sort of fragrant smell of flowers and baked goods that you've been uh, yes. been sort of smelling. Yeah. And you see you see a sign uh, of very nicely carved uh, wooden sign saying like Autumn's Brew uh, mm. and various other places. Um, but yeah. Uh, wow. What, what time in the morning is this? Uh, this is this is in the evening. Oh, okay. So the sun Beautiful. the sun's just going down. Um, gotcha. But yeah. But yeah, it does give off like the sort of warmth and and bustle as if it was morning, as the as the city is just about to sort of like dwindle down into nighttime. Beautiful. Um, yeah, you see some farm hands walk along the road, some guards making the round, and you guys are fully in Vico. What would you guys like to do? Well, uh, I'm of the mind that we should immediately get this kid. Mm -hmm. But, but we need to skill. stop in the town square, and I would like to bid adieu to uh, Ashwell. <laughs> yeah, you stop in the in the town square. What do you see in town square? Well, I should have had this open. Why did I close the folder? It's in Cities Vico. Yes. Uh, in, in the town square, you see... Um, uh, basically, the two most prominent things is you see a large uh, temple. Uh, Dimble, you can tell, you don't have to make a check. It's to the sort of all-father all of the gods in this setting. Uh, it's to Amatsu. Uh, mm -hmm. There's like a large sun like emblazoned across uh, a lot of the areas of the temple. Um, and there is also a, uh, a, a uh, store called the Crate and Barrel, which seems to uh, basically sell various... Uh, uh, miscellaneous things that people might need, like tools and such. Um, but yeah, you, you you stop, you pull up the cart at the side of the road. Uh, the streets are starting to get a lot more barren as you've made your way yeah. like into the center now, uh, and there's just the odd guard about. Um, yeah. But yeah. Yeah, well, I would like to kind of park it off somewhere near the market stalls, and uh, I'm going to get off and just immediately start oh. untying the horse. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. 
And uh, I, and <sighs> if I untie the horse, I'm just going to grab it by the reins and just kind of like approach Ashwell and just kind of stick my hand out with the uh, with the reins. He raises an eyebrow at you. It's your horse, after all. I have no use for such a clumsy beast. Hmm. Honestly, I thought you'd keep it. Appreciate the offer, though. If there's anything I can do for you, like grins. <laughs> yeah. Perhaps. Well, let's just say I'll be here for a few more days. I'm probably going to be spending quite a bit of time at the Griffin's Nest, given the uh, the stress that I've had to deal with for the last few days. So, if you're around for the next few days, see me there. Otherwise, I might find you in the future. He extends his hand out. Kitty and Clive. I'll uh, I'll I'll kind of take off one of my gloves. I just take <laughs> off my leather glove on my right hand, and I'll give him a handshake. Yeah, yeah. He shakes his hand. Yeah. He's like he he smiles. You kept your warm. word. Yeah, yeah. You kept your word. I thank you for that. Perhaps we will see each other in the future. Words. I just kind of look at him, just like you know, with this kind of half, you know, not convinced sort of look, <laughs> and just you can keep the horse and anything else that you need. We won't spread word of your involvement. There's no need at this point for another bard to lose his head of a stupidity. I appreciate that. Bimbo, live well. Maybe don't travel with this one for too much longer, like nods at Gideon. It'd probably <sighs> do worse for you than better. You know, Owen, I hope I never fucking see you again. <laughs> 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 what about God? What about Ankh? He doesn't care he about doesn't the say anything to like Ankh. Oh, fuck. We, did we get into town all right with Ankh? Ankh is currently in the cart. Like, there are, there are like, you know, the yeah, benches go up yeah, higher yeah, than yeah, Ankh yeah, yeah, goes. Yeah. So nobody has seen Ankh yet. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Whew. Alrighty. Well. Alright, well, safe travels. I'll be seeing you. Like I said, Griffin's Nest. Griffin's Nest. Thanks. Yeah, he, he heads off. He like waves you, waves you goodbye, and heads Did off. Did he take the, the horse? The night. Yeah, he's like leading the horse. Perfect. Cool. So you all guys right, are well, left with this a, is our time with a to cart. dismount. Yeah. And you have you have Dimble. You're like staring at Ankh, who's like staring back at you from like the bottom of the the cart. Don't move. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Good. That's. <laughs> oh God. Gideon, I want to go to sleep. Yes, once we get to the Lord's Hold, you can sleep. Can you just carry me, and I'll sleep on your back? You see, you see, um, <coughs> Harrius, the Lord's son, is like just like, looking around at the town. Yeah, and I'll just kind of, I'll just kind of like get a smile on my face when you say carry, and I'm like, perfect. I'm gonna go over and just like extend a extend a hand out to. Uh... Thank you. <laughs> That's um, interesting. No, sorry. Sorry, I'm, uh, uh... Well... What? No, it's just because you, uh, because you said, I'm gonna extend my hand, and then you actually extended your hand off screen. <laughs> yeah, yeah, extend my hand, I can see him. No, 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 so, um, I, uh, extend my hand, uh, and then just, like, onk. Onk, like, busts on over to, like, sort of, like, scurries over to the side. And, like, I'm gonna, like, open gets... up the side of my jacket. Oh, no. Okay. And just like cling to me. Oh no! <laughs> he nods. He like uh, he he gets to like a sitting position, like where his like little legs are hanging over the side of the car. Like knocks himself down and is gonna try and climb up your leg. I am going to roll a guard's um, perception check. Is there's probably one about though? They aren't like paying too much attention to you. So let me just roll. Oh no! Oh no! No no! Yeah. You see that that a guard, like just a stray <laughs> uh, guardsman. Uh, begin sort of like heading in your direction, but you do have like onk like currently like clinging underneath your jacket. You like <laughs> close back in. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Um. Excuse me, sir. I'll I'll just kind of like you know kind of slowly turn my head and look over at him. Evening, sir. Uh. And before it gets, because he's, he's, kind, eyes, of low, he's, he's kind of low status, I'm just going to be like, oh, perfect, you're here. Do you mind giving us an escort to the Lord's Hold? Uh, who the fuck are you? 
<laughs> Sassy cards. Uh, yeah, so this, and yeah, I'm gonna just gonna point to the Lord's Son and just kind of like put a put a loose hand on his, his left shoulder. This is, uh, this is Harry. You, mm -hmm. well, I'm just going to remind you, mm -hmm. because this is something that Dimble knows. Okay. You are specifically not supposed to let anyone uh, know that you are traveling with him. Okay, in that case, I would not you, do you that. Can, you can consider that that is broken from the fact that your main mission was to take him to the uh, Valens province, and that has failed, so maybe the whole thing is off, but you were specifically not to, like, be... Yeah, 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 yeah. This, yeah. Like, he's, he's dressed in, like, commoners. Okay, okay, fit, thank you. Just thank so you. that yeah. you're aware of that, yeah. I, I, I appreciate that. Yeah, I would be like... No, 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 no. I so I just kind of I'll just kind of look at the guard and just what well, you haven't heard. This is Dimble. He's going to <gasps> he's the gnome that's been sent to reinforce your portcullis, make it coal powered, so that you guys don't have to use the wench. Just I'm just looking at Gideon with these really wide open eyes, like, oh god. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then I look at the guard with the same eyes. I'm like. Well, he's never described it like that, but yeah, <laughs> we're uh, we're here to do some work, basically. Right. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say <laughs> I'm gonna allow not 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 a help action, but I'm gonna allow like that to be Dimble's sort of guidance. So, uh, <laughs> Thank you. Gideon, Thank you. Give me a persuasion check. I would have definitely uh, guidance. Uh, you can add a D4 tell me, to that. Tell me what it is. Hold oh, on. okay. Hold on. I'm you using my to, inspiration, boy. Need so, to do that. So reroll. Oh my fucking god, it's I'm the four. worst. You can roll hey! So that's an eight. Um, okay. hey. yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going I'm going to roll something because Owen was about to say this before you guys Oh went no. So I'm gonna roll something for Owen. Erwin is literally <laughs> okay, don't mind. Don't We mind. all fucking He's sitting suck. There. He's sitting there <laughs> Give like, me your inspiration, like, damn you. You already you used it, I can't yeah, use you it can't, again. You can't use it twice. Yeah. I know, I know. <laughs> yeah. Um Sorry, I haven't heard anything about that. You might want to go to it's that direction. But first off, can could you open your coat for me, sir? He like sort of like takes his spear from his side and like is is like warily holding it. Yeah. It's like looking at you, Gideon. On whose authority? <laughs> <laughs> um, he like just looks down at himself and looks at you. He's like. And he just like points the spear at you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just like the fucking Lord's authority. What? I just smack my face like God damn it, Gideon, you fucking moron. Owen, Owen, like gets gets out of the car. <sighs> Fuck's sake. Yeah. All right, uh, sir. Like goes over to the guard. Yeah. I... Oh yeah, yeah. yeah go what, ahead. What, what, Let what, Erwin. Okay. Erwin uh, can do what he needs yeah. to do. Owen like pulls out a small pouch from his side. <sighs> Look. This one's a fucking idiot. This one's more of an idiot, but they're with me. And he like sort of like opens up like part of um, his his uh, jacket and like shows the sort of inside of a bit of material which has the symbol of Blackwell on it. Oh! Roll to see if the guard actually knows what that is. <laughs> it's not going to be especially hard. And he does there beat a ten. So yeah, he his eyes widen. He's like, now if you could take this, and he just like puts it into one of the guard's hands and like folds the fingers up around it and be on your way nothing said about this we would appreciate it and I'm not talking about these two and he smiles and I'm going to have him roll a charisma check what was that music might be a, this song might be a bit loud by the way so I'm going to turn it down uh, a tap. thanks yeah just like relative to the rest of the music mm -hmm. there we go uh, so yeah I'm going to have him roll a charisma check here 12. Uh -huh. Let me have the guard roll a wisdom check against that. 18. Yeah, the guard's not having it. Yeah. The guard, like, like, like he, he looks down at his hand, he's like, did you just try to bribe an official guardsman of Lucius? Like, throws the coin purse on the ground, and he is going to try to arrest Owen. Uh, oh, God. Just, like, grabs Owen by the arm. <laughs> We have Owen make a strength check versus the guard's strength check. I'm just watching, like, what the fuck is this 2 a.m. Yeah, entertainment? The guard's got him by the arm. Um, yeah. The next round, if Owen uh, doesn't get out of this grapple, there's going to be manacles on him unless either of you help. Anyway. Um, I am. Oh, God. Can I. Can I use my acrobatics at all <laughs> to 
do anything for this. You could somersault around the end. No, no, to me... fucking to roast to this guard somehow. Uh, explain just, to me. Just... Explain to me what you want to do, as opposed to saying the skill you want to do. Explain to me um, what you want to do, and we'll we'll decide what yeah. skill that is, not the other way around. That's that's good. Um. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, I don't want to punch him in the face. Like you could, you could, you could like slip between them and then like try and break them apart. That would be as close to acrobatics as you could make in this situation. <laughs> yeah, but it's really an athleticsy sort of situation. Uh, at this point. if if I may, as Gideon's debating, I'm just gonna yeah, like you, you. You have a in a follow initiative order. These two are gonna go like top of the round, and then it's yeah, like yeah, you yeah. two. So you two have like an action to use here okay. before they get another. Well, turn. I just kind of want to say over the guard. Uh, I, I just know these guys. Can I go with my kid? Uh, just There'll be the questions guard. with you. I'll be escorting you to the Lord's Keep as you've supposedly oh. got some work for him. Oh, okay. That's fine. That'll, and yeah. if that proves to be true, then you won't be. Arrested. All right. This is fine. Yeah, I'll this just one stand. has committed a crime. And he's going to try and, uh, yeah, you do guys, it. you guys oh, helping? Oh, God. Gideon! Okay, I'm so sorry. Do it or I'm don't so do sorry. it. Um, uh, I, I'm just going to look at Dimble and just, if anything happens, I want you to take Ankh and I want you to take Alda and take them to the King's Hold. And I want to punch the guard in the No! Place. No! You wanted to roll kill me. this guy a couple days ago. Roll me, roll me, roll me to hit. You crazy uh, I'm going to roll, and this is What do this I is roll? Just, a strength, this, or? Okay, this is just going to be a sheer luck roll. This is a d20 to see if there is another guard in the area. Oh no. If I get higher, because I said I already said it's sparse, so I'm going to say it's a hard DC. If I get higher, if I get 15 or higher, there is another guard. There is not another guard. What do, what do I do? Sight. Do I roll a, do I roll a strength or what do I roll? Uh, you are rolling to hit him in the face because you are trying yeah, to hit yeah. him in the yeah, face. Yeah, I know. So what's, so roll what's me, the roll roll me, for You are proficient in your own fist, so it's a strength attack, essentially. Uh, so it's strength <laughs> plus proficiency. Okay. So it's a strength check plus two, basically. Yeah, go for it. Oh Nine. come on! <laughs> yeah, you go. You go to hit him plus in, in two. the. Uh, yeah, plus two. So it's an eleven. Oh uh, no! You go to hit. You go to hit him, and the guard like um, <sighs> pulls like a rough sort of like uh, wooden buckler around and like blocks it. It's like oh god. And now you've committed a crime. Fuck. And he's going to try. And on his action, he's got a manacle. He's gonna finish man manacling Owen. Now, yeah, oh, God. Uh, in the That's background, and then his bonus yeah. actually just like throws Owen into the ground, manacled now, and. Uh... Mm. And yeah, that's his that's his sort of full action as he's sort of like holding his spear and shield, like preparing to like do do battle with the two of you, I guess. Oh no, I'm I'm gonna like back away with the sun. I don't have any weapons drawn. I'm just gonna kinda hold one hand up that's not on the sun's shoulder, and I'm just gonna try backing away very slowly. Not not, not yeah. like trying to leave, like getting just five feet away, basically. So if they tussle, I don't wanna get collateral damaged. Sort of thing. Yes, but I want to stay in the area, basically, and like also mm -hmm. because because you've actively gone to punch him in the face, uh, Gideon. I'm gonna roll Onk to see if Onk can hold on to you. Oh no! What? Onk can hold on to you. Nice. Okay. All uh, right. Um. Do Do we want to actually go to initiative order, <laughs> or? Uh, I'm gonna continue using okay, this photo. That's fine. So, so it's essentially um, it's it's God, then Owen, can, then uh, then Dimble, then Gideon. Can Can I just this, say something to the boy as I'm just like, ever so slightly. Oh, okay. So Irwin gets his turn before I can I can do anything. Yeah. Yep. Owen, Owen, Owen is basically he's going to use because uh, because he is bound by the arms. I'm going to say it's his full movement to pull himself to his feet. Oh from prone. God, I so, know exactly um, what I'm going to so do. So he gets himself he gets himself to his feet yeah. and he is he's currently like ten feet away. So he's preparing to do something for his next action. So that's his yeah. turn, basically getting himself onto his feet like while his arms are bound. Yep. But yeah, that's Irwin. Yeah, I'm just going to say, well, shit. Uh, good, good going, good going, guys. I'll, I'm just gonna like just take a couple steps back, just literally only about five feet, slowly with the boy, and I'll just say to the boy like, "And this is why you don't commit a felony for no good reason." <laughs> I just shout that. Yeah, the the, the uh, Harry's like looks at you. He's like, "Should should I say something?" Or no, I was... no, no, no. It's fine. Don't worry about it. He, he had this coming. And then I'm I'm going to uh, I'm going to open up my trench coat and just like run onk to Dimble and I'm no! going to Alder and I'm going to chuck it at the guard. I'm going to chuck Alder at the guard. Jesus Christ, man. Okay, you're going to throw. So let let me get Alder's sheet out. Uh, do you want to make this attack or do you want me to roll it? 
Uh, you should roll it because it's okay. I'm not actually yeah, you, under, you, under control of him. You, un <laughs> you, you do have you do have access you do have access to his sheet. Um, I do, but like it's yeah. more it's but more yeah, you, interesting you, if you control you him. You pull him out of the bag and throw him, and let's see if Older just from this is basically like you're just throwing him. Older's not really doing it, doing anything with this. Oh my fucking god! Oh no! Thrown him well enough. <laughs> that he just smashes into this guard, and this guard was expecting like more punches. So Alda like goes past the shield that he was using like up in front of his face and hits him like dead center in the stomach, like knocking the wind out of him, and doing six oh. damage. Oh. Nice. oh god! And uh, yeah, with the with the rest of my action, I would like to. Uh, I I just want to run towards him and get up in his space. I know I can't grapple him necessarily because I don't have action surge, but um, actually I'm gonna use second wind. Okay. Yeah, to heal. Yeah, I roll a. That's a D. D ten plus uh, two because your fighter level is two. Yep. When'd you take damage? I have full HP, guys. Um, he got, I, he got damage from when the the pterodactyl the bit on his ah, arm. Ah, nice. Yeah. Nice. Yep. So yes, uh, you 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 throw older and then take a moment to sort of like center yourself while the god's distracted. Yeah. Because like, what the fuck. Goblin! So he's just like yelling out. Uh, oh, I'm gonna no. make another d20 to see yeah. if anyone is in any guards are within earshot. Again, 15 is why I have to get higher than. <gasps> 15 I do get, get so another yeah. guard will be joining at the next round. Yeah. Uh, like not not within fighting range, but will be like yeah, within yeah, side yeah, range yeah, yeah. in mm -hmm. the next round. So yes, the guard um is going to go for an attack on Alder. Bring it. So he he, he plunges this. He has, a, he has a turtle cell. I will I will let you know. Yes, he does, so he has a plus one to his AC. One AC extra. <laughs> yep. Yes, I've already noted that down. Get fucked. Uh, yeah, so this says short sword, but it is a spear. Uh, 19 hey, will God. hit. Uh-oh. And do four piercing to Alder's seven HP. Oh, no. Uh, oh, no. I mean, if he so kills Alder, it's not that HP. big of a deal, because he can't technically kill him, kill him. He just can disable well. him, so I have to fix the shit out of him. Yes, exactly. Oh, uh, okay. Um, yeah. Um, but yeah, he just stabs the spear and it goes like into Alder's like back torso area and just like spears him and like lifts up the spear. Alder slowly like shakes it to get rid of it so he can attack again. And that's his turn. Um, Erwin is going to try and headbutt this dude. Like, cause he just go like that while his hands are bound and try and headbutt this dude. Uh, so that's a d20 plus two to see if he hits. And he does. <laughs> uh... So that just, I would just say, because there is no dice to be doubled, he just gets double his one damage, so he gets two damage on the guard. That's beautiful. Uh, so the guard has taken eight damage. He's looking very rough as his, like, his his helmet is, like, uh, his his hair is, like, coming loose under his helmet. He's, like, sweating slightly, and he's, like, looking about in fear, and he, you can see he's, like, looking over his shoulder as another guard comes running out. Um, and Dimble, it's your action. You're just going to keep moving away. <laughs> uh, yeah... Yeah, and if, uh... Oh, God. Because Onk's out in the open now. Mm-hmm. Uh, what's Onk doing? Onk, Onk, is currently, Onk is currently looking up at you, waiting for you to make a decision, and Harrius is, like, looking down at Onk, like, worried and concerned. Yeah, I'm just gonna point to Onk. Lay on the ground. Don't move. Okay? It's gonna be okay. Uh, roll me... You have to roll me charisma checks, because... You have yeah. Not well, I'm, I'm yeah, I'm saying it's gonna be level. okay. Can we persuasion? Uh, yes. Yeah, I'm trying to. Not gonna be that hard to win. Okay. Persuasion. Yeah. 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 He 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 like looks back over at Gideon, and then he just like goes flat on the ground, like face like back on the ground, like face upwards. <laughs> um. Oh man. Yeah. You know, sorry, um, yeah. Mm -hmm. A guard, uh, the other guard comes running, he's like, Stop in the name of Lucius! Like, starts running uh, in. And um, he's just gonna, that's his turn, Is just dashing. Okay. So he's almost up to you guys. Yeah. Um, I'll, I'll say something if he seems to take interest. And by take interest, I mean, like, rush up to me and Onk or something. I'll say something. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, I'm just going to let him do his job. Yeah, he seems to be running over to the fight that's yep. happening. Yep, assumed um, as much. We're staying, you know. Off to the side, but still within sight and whatnot. Yep. Uh, okay, Gideon. Um, so turn. what? What's the what's the guard currently doing? He's like holding his face, or he or is he? He's currently he's got he's got his spear and shield still, but he's just like 
he, he looks extremely sort of worn down is taking a heavy breath he's like looking desperately around and he keeps like looking back over his shoulder to see how like how close his guard friend is to like joining the fight he seems to be he seemed to until like the guard showed up and yelled he seemed to be like considering running but since the guard is the other guard has shown up he's like uh reconsidering his options he thinks he can stay and fight gotcha um i am oh god uh well i'm not good at actually fighting uh in terms of hand to hand so i am going to pull out my rapier uh oh mm -hmm. and i would like to slash one of his uh tendons on one of his limbs to make him fall over so okay. i'm going to try and i'm going to try and disable him essentially so so something this is that, something that won't scar him for life yeah yeah, yeah. non-lethal and non like super okay cool um an 11 will horrible. miss Unless yeah, someone horrible. wants to give you uh, their inspiration, that will just miss. Ah. And from the sounds of it, he's, he's, he's <laughs> you got yourself into the situation. Yeah. Unless it means your life, I'm not getting you out of it. Yep. So yeah, you 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 go to like slash. Uh, you probably go for like a very sort of precise uh, tendon, and he like moves the shield in the way of like a like a um, like move, moves the shield like down in front of like uh, the back of his knee, uh, which you were trying to sort of like poke into. Um, and he avoids that. I'm just, I'm just gonna like just stab at him, like cease and desist. Oh my god! Pressing business here. He's the guard. You. <laughs> that's my fucking life. And he's gonna yeah. go and stab at you. Yeah, uh, yeah that's my fucking This time life. at you, not at Alder. Uh, so again, short sword, but this is a spear. Uh, seven oh, will nice. not hit you. Cool. Uh, the other guard is now in the fray. He uses the rest of his movement to catch up to you, and he's going to try and stab at probably the goblin first. Uh, so Alder. That will hit bitch. Alder, and <gasps> Alder oh, no. is out of commission. So oh, Alder, God. like he he stabs Alder, and this time, like instead of um, instead of going like into the back, it actually goes through the uh, the the patch of hair that you got from uh, from uh, Ayla Sunderstone. Um, so this sort of like blonde patch of hair, the spear just goes straight in, and blood starts sort of like pulling into it slightly. Uh, yeah. and, and you hear like probably like the skull of the goblin like uh, fracture and and there's gonna be some damage there and you're like oh blasted imbecile yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Bastard. You, know, you know that's gonna be an issue later on uh but yeah older is currently out of commission um so yes uh erwin is going to What's he doing? realizing the situation he's gonna go over to you uh dimble uh he's one of the guards that's gonna try and attack the opportunity to him and Damn, they're rolling so good yeah they are I've been rolling good for you guys six. as well. So that's nice. Mm, yeah, that's six. Uh, okay, Owen takes like a, a hefty sort of like stab into his, uh, like probably like a spot between the ribs, but it doesn't seem to like puncture a long or anything as he like grab, he tries to grab at it as he like groans because <laughs> his arms are behind his back and he's like running towards you. It's like, fucking gnome, help me out. <laughs> like sort of like yeah. bends down, <laughs> like yeah, bending the manacles at you. If, if I can react, uh, I'm just gonna like, my. I, I'm gonna cross my arms, just shake my head and look at the manacles, look at him. I don't have to be a cleric of Kyral to know that this is fucking stupid. <laughs> just lie down. <laughs> Fuck you. He's not gonna lie down. But of yeah, course. Just sort of like, yeah. he's, he's, he's out of the combat for this purposes, <laughs> for these purposes. Um, so Gideon, you are now alone. <laughs> Uh, with these two guards. Yep, uh, I'm, uh, once again, I'm going to, uh, try and, uh, stab this one guard in the, in the kneecap or whatever. The same the guy? Yeah, try yeah. and disable him. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, he, he, this, oh this guard is especially swift. I'm rolling horribly. Yeah. Fuck yeah. God damn it. Yeah, you're rolling really though. Uh, and, and, like, you, you assumed him to be simply a, a common or a mook, but it seems like this, this guard has some sort of conviction, some sort of, uh, mm. ideal in his, in his mind. Erwin with an E, yep. uh, music writer. Mm -hmm. uh, but yes, yeah. uh, so that's your turn. Uh, that means it's the guard's turn, and now both of them are going to try and stab at you. One, two, one of them hits. Yeah, one of them will hit. Uh, does five piercing damage as as it just like nicks you along the uh, along the sort of uh, shoulder area, makes like a sort of deep cut. Blood starts sort of seeping down. You can feel the warmth uh, come yeah. down your arm. You'll and... pay for that, boy. Uh, the the yeah. Probably older than you. Uh, okay, so those are the two guards. Uh, unless Dimble wants to do anything. Uh Erwin's not going to do anything. Hmm. 
No, I'm, I'm not going to do anything. Again, I'm just kind of preparing to say something, but I know I can do that anytime. So, yep, I'm not doing anything. Mm -hmm. I'm just making okay. sure the boy is, like, you know, not the center of attention at any point ever. Yeah, yeah. Like, You're just trying to keep him out of the limelight. I have a prepared action. You where, see, you see yeah. there are a couple of people um, now, like, glancing around the street, but their eyes aren't on, like, the... the th they're on the fight. The, yeah. Yeah. They're on the fight and yeah. occasionally lo looking over at the manacled guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the and probably like one person spots the goblin that's lying on the ground, oh, Jesus. but nobody else really notices it because it's quite small. Um, um. But yeah, you. Uh, uh, I would uh, basically. I just have a prepared action to like stop, stop the sun if he tries to do anything overt. If okay. that makes sense. So anything that would draw attention yeah. to him, like if he were to try to shout something or like make a move to join the fight, I would I would want to stop him. Basically. Yeah, no, don't worry. He's not confident enough to do anything. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. Yep, yes. I'm keeping uh, him at bay. Gideon, it's your turn. Yeah, um, I'm, I'm pretty much seeing red at this point, because uh, Alder, so... Alder's uh, been ruined, what? your clothes are being ruined. Uh -oh. Yeah, you go for that guy. Uh, is this a kill blow? Uh, no, this. I want to stab him uh, straight through, um, like... Straight through his kneecap. Oh, geez. Or somewhere around there, so that, so that it, you know, like... It's not going to kill him or disable him his whole life, but, you know, he can't. He's not going to be able to yeah, get up I or think, do I anything. Think, I think I think because you have a rapier, you don't go, like, straight through, but you, yeah. you like, hit him in, uh, but, and especially because his, like, shield is pointed forwards, you actually, like, use your speed to get round to the side and stab into him, and you probably, you hear, like, this this groan of pain as he, like, falls down. Uh, you've probably, like, um, damaged the uh, part that attaches, like, the kneecap to the rest of his, his leg, so it's oh, probably going to, like, just be, like, that leg is not going to ever be fully functional ever again but it's mm. not gonna be like you know ir uh he's not he's still gonna work as a guard you know he's not gonna be but he's yeah. just not gonna be running any marathons that's what you're he's, saying he's not gonna he's just not gonna be an adventure like me after so, this, exactly he got he got he got yeah, rapier yeah. i think what he's trying to tell you is and he falls he falls down grabbing his he's like <sighs> oh no! Yeah, 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 yeah! Oh no! Oh no! Uh, no, no! Yeah, he falls. He falls down, like grabbing his knees, like crying out in pain. Like it's really loud. Uh, but then eventually, like he probably due to uh, blood loss and various other means, he 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 falls unconscious. And I'm uh, gonna look at the other guard and just. Would you like a try, or do you want not to want to have children in the near future? <gasps> just gotta like look at him. Yeah. Yeah, he his spear clatters to the floor. Be gone. <clears throat> just like his his nodding like starts out slowly, <clears throat> just, like, slowly increases as he just sort of like dashes like like in the opposite direction away from you. Like he's still got his shield, but his spear like clatters to the floor as this sort of guard is is laying like in a pool of his blood from his knee, and you stand there sort of in the street. Yeah. <sighs> And I'm gonna. I, I, are we? So I'm gonna go over and I'm gonna grab the uh, the guard. If is he knocked out or this this one uh, he guard? Is, he's, or he's currently. He's, he's probably. He's currently not unconscious, but he's basically like incapacitated with pain. Yeah, right yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna look. I'm gonna grab suck. him by the uh, by the collar and just like kind of bring him up to me. What's your name? Yeah, you grab him by like the chain the chain shirt like underneath. Uh, let me get his name because I have a list of guard names. So bear with. <laughs> Uh, might as well use them. Uh, here they are. Uh, his name is uh, Marcus Harrod. Well, Marcus. Marcus. Yeah. <laughs> well, Marcus. Fuck. I'll see you again before I leave this city. Try and fix your legs. So you can be back up working by at least to, uh, by at least a week from now, so you don't starve oh, to death. All right, just oh god. And then and then you know scum just look like down you that, <laughs> that ruin this place for the rest of us. All right, just just uh. I'm just and gonna, and all that tea was slow, made. <laughs> slowly let him go. No, yeah, I'll yeah. slowly just let him go and just Marcus. We'll be back, Marcus. And I'm gonna oh. just collect Alder. Uh, Put it in my bag and just look at Dimble. We must get going. Well, yeah, as he's collecting Alder, I'm going to walk over to the guard and look down at him. Not kneel down. I don't have to kneel down. Let me like, yeah, can you take us to the uh, the Lord's Palace? I'll heal your leg. It'll be like nothing happened. Uh, if he... I'm going to make I'm gonna make a wisdom check. Here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 
you're obviously still going to have to charge the guy who committed four cases of assault and battery, but, um, it's probably... Fuck both of you. And he just collapses. Yeah, I... Yeah. Like, uh... now unconscious. Uh... We don't need a grand entry, Dimble. Uh... And I expect a full pardon from your... And I just you look see, at, you I just see, look like, at the you boy. You see, like, a, like a halfling, like, kind of a, a pudgy halfling woman, like, with just a hand over her mouth, like, just quickly, like, sort of, like, dart back into her house. Yeah. I... I... <sighs> Let me we think. We should head out, lest we be assailed again. Well... I just look at... I'll just look at Dimble, yeah, like, Gideon, sort of with this weird, disappointed Gideon, look. You know, some of us have to think ahead. And if you keep doing shit like this, you may get pardoned, but you make a lot of enemies, Gideon. Okay? And I can't say... I can't... I would... I, yeah? Uh, just because just cause the chat has recommended something, mm. I would allow you, Dimble, if you wanted to, to heal this guy without making him conscious, but that's... You know, oh, I, well, no, I'm, I'm going to assume. The thing is yeah, the... Yeah, I, I want... If I, if I heal him, then, you know, I want to be able to make him conscious, I guess. Um, but okay. thank you. I appreciate that. But I would. I was just. I was just letting you know your option. Okay. Just because the chat. The chat I'm, was saying like. I have. Lord. I have full intentions. If I get a pardon from the Lord to go back oh. and fix that guy's tendon in his knee. Yeah, I don't. Like I have full. I have full. You know things to. His... You know full. Um, intentions to do that. Just because he's. You know like Gideon <laughs> respects sense of duty. But it was just like, you're. You know you're in my way. Stupid. You're not worth like, my time. Yeah. yeah, yeah, exactly. I, like, oh god. And you know, Gideon being the level two, uh, level five, sorry that he is, he oh, takes on two Jesus city guards by himself. Yeah, yeah. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna look at Gideon, and be like, okay, so I'm gonna heal him, and he's gonna take us to the Lord's, the Lord's. Pa is it a palace or a manor or a keep? It's or it's a... it's a it's a manor, but manor. it's mostly made of like stone, so it's kind okay. of castle-y. Okay. But you know, on the sort of scale, more on the scale of a manor. Than I'll a call castle. it a manor. Yeah, I, yep. he's gonna he'll if I can convince him to, he'll take us to the Lord's Manor, and maybe you'll get off easier. Okay, what do you think of that? Because if we just leave him here, we are fucked. I didn't think so. So fucked. What's one peasant boy in chain mail? Compared to another peasant boy, it's, it's not the boy. In it's disguise. not the boy that matters. And I just look, and I just look at, and I look over <laughs> at the boy. Raises an eyebrow and like looks at the camera. <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. Or a peasant boy okay. in disguise, like, <laughs> okay. da -da 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 -da. like you know, the yeah. fact, the fact that he's just a person doesn't matter that much. It's the fact, like, is he wearing like a seal or something on on his front on his armor anywhere, like a, uh, yeah, a badge? He's got, he's got a um, he's he's not got like a gambeson, but he's got yeah. sort of like a. Uh, because these the the guards who protect the town aren't as nice as the ones who protect the main yeah um, the main the thing. province. So it's sort of like just a mishmash of like he's got he's obviously got like a chain shirt underneath just what is essentially like a normal commoner's uh, shirt, but he oh. has like a a a, uh, a emblem like sewn into the shirt of mm -hmm. uh, the Lucius. Which if you look yes. down in the bottom right corner of the map is is that yep that one yep. yeah this 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 one over here yeah 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 <sighs> yeah. I don't care about the boy. I mean, I care he lives, but that, that's what matters. And I just point to the symbol. That, the fact that he's wearing that means we're fucked if we don't do something about this. You know what, just fuck If it mattered, it, I just look, if it mattered, <sighs> Dimble, he'd be in opposition and we'd be in his. I, I don't, I, 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 Why do you think we were sent? To get this mission done. Yeah, I'm just this is what people have purpose. I'm just not people gonna that wear symbols like these don't have purpose. This gives them temporary purpose. Never mind, you're a layman. Let's go. Uh, I'm I'm not I'm not I'm gonna I'm not, I'm not gonna let you keep doing the thinking for me, Gideon. Just just stop. Yeah. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put put a hand down on the man's probably specifically on the man's thigh. Try not to get blood on my hand, but like, you know, try to subsume the wound. And I will cast mm -hmm. cure wounds with my last spell slot. Okay. And you're you're doing this to conscious or no? Yes, too conscious. Okay, so yeah, you heal him. That is... He's like groggily, like looks around, like hey, for ten health. Fuck. Nice, so that's a good one. <sighs> yeah, the wound, the wound almost entirely seals up. Yep, I, I'm like now I'm my hands are on my knees and I am kneeling, but my head is pretty close to his at this point. Yeah. Hey. Yep. You okay? Yeah, he like focuses. Fuck you. Okay. Like goes goes to like try and reach for the for the spear, but he's just too weak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Okay, come on. I, I'm, I'll, I'll try to help him up. I actually, I'm actually relatively strong. I try to help, yeah. start to help him up. I'm like, hey, hey, you. Okay, you, 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 you know what's going on. He, 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 like throws you off of him. He's like, I don't need your fucking help. Okay, well. He gets to his feet of his own. Oh, great. Okay. <laughs> like, he's, he's like, got his hand, like, on, on, on a leg as he's, like, like sort of, like, hunched over. But yeah. he's, like, actually, like, standing up and he's, like, looking down and he's, like, you better get out of my sight. There'll be a bounty on you by tomorrow. Okay, sir. Both of you. Sir. Yeah, and I just, I just, that last sir was, like, with almost my, a pseudo command voice, basically. Like, mm -hmm. I want to get his attention and just for him to shut up. Like, sir. We are working in the best interests of the Lucius family, and it would be in your best interest to take us to the manor. The Lord can speak on our behalf. Um, roll me a persuasion check. Okay. Uh, With disadvantage. Okay, I'm going to use inspiration proactively then to make it a normal roll. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Okay, ten... Uh, I have nothing I can blow on this, so. Yeah, no, he's not helping you. Yeah. God he's a fucking... waste of time, Dimble. We don't Go need to him. the fifth layer of fucking hell. That one is, uh, is that the cold one? I don't remember. All right, well, uh... have a nice day. <laughs> fucking assholes. Yeah, I just, like, come on, let's go. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, it's and I, I just kind of, like, um... Can I be like slashing or like trying to bust uh uh Irwin's manacles? <laughs> um let me just check. Uh by the way, um the the layer of Pivden is is basically like a layer of torture. Pivden, thank you. Okay. Uh, I, that's the fifth layer. Yeah, he wouldn't know that. My my to my say. hells are different from the normal hells. Oh, okay. So cool. That, it's not usually There's still a frozen one though, uh, right? You can uh Sorry. Yeah, yeah, there is, there okay, is like, a nice one. Go ahead. Uh, I'm going to have Erwin, because he's been struggling, I'm going to have him make a, a dex check to see if he can break out of his own accord. He cannot. Um, yeah, so so what are you trying to do? Well, the thing is, if I can... Um, I know for a fact, depending on how, how loose the chain is or how tight the chain is, like, how tight is it? Uh, the, the chain... These seem to be, like, pretty professional manacles. Like, these are proper, like, cast iron sort of things. Oh, I was just gonna say, because if depending on how tight the chain is, um, if you actually just twist them in such a way with a little bit of leverage, you can just pop them open, even if they're made really well, just because of, like, how... Mm -hmm. it, like, uh, the length of the chain dictates, um how harder they are to break. If they were, you like, can, if he's, like, you really can, you can make together, you can you make can make a strength check. It. If you want yeah. to, you can make a strength check to try and break them. Um, like, there is a set DC for these. And the DC is 20. <laughs> yeah. Well, so, yeah, no, yeah. So, so I'll just yeah. grab, I'll just grab Erwin and just hold still. Yeah, the, the, there's, there's a, like, uh, a couple of the links, you notice, like, have a bit of rust growing on them around the, yeah. uh, around the section. So you, you, like, probably, like, grab either side of the link and just bend the metal. And yeah, yeah, I just kind of, like, you know, snap his wrists together so that it, it breaks or whatever. Yeah, yeah, and, just... and you, you you get him free, but the the the, the like they're still the bound around his wrists. Still... But yeah, yeah, these wrists. Didn't nice think I'd be saying this, but I appreciate it, Corpsman. <sighs> so what are we gonna fucking do about that? Nods over it like the the guardsman's like sort of like hobbling away with his spear, like trying probably like heading towards the direction of the nearest yeah. guards post. Well, I suggest we get to the Lord's Hold before that happens. We'll have a pardon before morning. You better hope so. Good plan, Corpsman. And, uh... <sighs> what about this one? Like, just po points a thumb down uh, towards the ground at Onk, who's just, like, lying down looking Oh, up. shit. Like, like he looks over at you, Gideon just sort of, like, blinks at you. The... Onk? That is but a champion that helped... Uh, that is going to help deliver the Lord's son to him. I'm sure he'll be understanding. Good luck convincing his doorman of that. I don't need to. What the fuck? Well, we gotta fucking go! I agree. Let's move. So gather Eat your this. green shit stain and let's go! Yeah, no, I've already got Alder in my bag. No, not that one! The other green shit stain! I'll just grab him by the, uh, <laughs> by the back of his shirt and, like, just kind of huff, you know, hoist him up onto me. Onk doesn't have a shirt. Well, fine. Uh, By the back of his skin, like he was a puppy. 
Yeah, yeah, you just like grab him by like a bit of loose skin on the neck and just like lift him up. Yeah, right. and just put him on my shoulder and let's head to the Lord Told. You know your way from here, I assume. I look at the boy. Uh, yes. Of, of course, yes. Let's I go. Show us the way. Let's go. Lead on then. Yeah. Um, uh, Harrius will lead you guys over there, and with that, I think we will take another break here. Beautiful. Oh boy. Uh, yeah. Well, guys, so... I almost got fucking killed by like, two guards. <laughs> I was really hoping they would drop you, to be honest. That would have been amazing. That would have been a much well, see, easier. The, well, see, 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 that's the thing. Encounter. You're hoping that they would drop you, but Gideon Clive has yet. Oh. <laughs> To go I down. Realized... Hey, for his horrible choices. I know. I know. I just realized Owen Owen's manacles aren't broken and various other things should have happened, but Owen's manacles is the only one I'm going to retro. Uh, you guys are both exhausted as fuck. Shit. Yeah, that's true. Oh, well, Damn, I, was, I, didn't... I was forgetting that. I only made one check throughout that entire thing. Yeah, so. that's that's fine. It's mostly Gideon. But yeah, uh, Owen is still in his manacles, so never mind. That makes sense. That part. Oh, oh shoot. Even I critted. Damn. Oh, yep, God. Because you have disadvantage. <laughs> Oh my god, you yeah, never would have won that fight! <laughs> I mean, his attacks aren't with disadvantage yet, so... Oh, that's true, I'm sorry. It's just ability yeah. checks.